The herring are so abundant that, in spite of the whales, most manage to reach the shallows. And here they spawn. Fertilizing the eggs with clouds of sperm. Once herring thrived here in an abundance we can barely imagine today. They used to turn shorelines white with spawn right across the North Pacific, from Japan to California. With industrialized fishing techniques, it's all too easy to over exploit these breeding stocks. All right, first off, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, by Shimei Aoshai, by Shimei the Wadi Yaw by Shemi Al Shai for allowing me to do another video. Third Spirit. The Wadi Yaw by Shemi Al Shai for giving us this truth of worms. Double honor to our apostle elders at Great Millstone and salutation and blessings to the whole for elect. Uh, I was going to show a clip, uh, maybe in post production, Lord will, if I can get it. But uh, most likely, Lord willing, I'm put a clip up in the front and it's uh, basically from this uh, documentary I was watching called From Our World. On Netflix, and uh, they're speaking about these type these types of fish. I forget what type of fish it was. When I put the clip, he should say it, but I forget the name of the fish. But they're talking about the uh, so how the just to give you a quick synopsis of what it, what I'm talking about. So these particular fish, uh, I believe it was a to form of trout. These were I'll say trout from uh wrong it should correct it when uh in post production but those those fish they would the fish specifically would feed sea 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 uh damn it sea lions which are uh basically seals whales and and uh eagles bald eagles and they will feed and feast off of off of these off of these fish during their during their season of mating and during this mating season a bunch of them because they will come they live like in the mid part of the ocean and they'll come closer to the top to to mate to mate with each other and in this documentary they were saying the amount that the those sea lions whales and and uh uh bald eagles was basically minuscule to how many fish that there is meaning showing you that the heavenly father has a way of life that that works out perfectly and, and you can see it within these animals man how their food system is very balanced man but getting to the point during the mating season it would turn the the a part of the sea from from where they're at i believe it was in the closer region to japan it would turn that like the bay that they're at white from all the sperm but, but, big but, it would, it, it used to be, past tense, it used to be, there would be so many fish during their mating season, it would expand from Japan to California. And in the, in the clip that I'm going to put up, you, you, you're going to be able to see that. And you're going to be able to hear what, what, what the dude is saying. Showing you that this world is fucking 20 times weaker than it used to be, man. And that was just in a, uh, through a couple years, man. And it, you know whose pro who's fault it is that the, the mating cycle isn't as much as it used to be from modern man fishing, man. From industrializing fishing. So they've taken advantage and the fish have basically become small, man. Hey, if... If we had time in this kingdom, everything would die, man. Fish, the coral reef, 
our air supply man everything will die in that same documentary before it was speaking about how the coral reef is basically fucking dying man and if you don't know the majority of our oxygen comes from water man yes tree has trees have a have a part in it but the majority of our oxygen comes from all the bodies of water around this planet so hey if without water man if you destroy this water <laughs> we're fucked man we're even more fucked than we already are so i'm gonna just get a few scriptures man and and man we have to we have to get out of here man because the ruler that's in charge is fucking destroying the planet earth man he's destroying it man he's physically and mentally destroying this planet man he's physically destroying this planet and he's mentally destroying the people this is uh second Ezra 14 and 14 uh start at 17 actually second Ezra 14 and 17 for look how much the world shall be weaker through age so much more shall evils increase up upon them that dwell therein so the world is weak in my mind the world is weak the world has become weak in a in a time in this short time huh because the world is a if you're looking at a child since a 13 year old child that's young that's young and the earth is only roughly the thirteen thousand years old so for this earth to be in the state that it's in and how fucked up it is that's really really bad man is really bad esau edom has been destroying this planet man because it's through man who's doing this shit man nature nature has its own course man the nature doesn't go off from the words of yahweh bashim yahweh shah only time it, it it seems to go off is when esau edom and these other nations start fucking with it man let's just see if i can find this scripture I know the word beast is in it i believe it's job 12 and it talks about looking at the beast how to, how they how basically how the beast get down man how the animals of this earth work man because the animals of this work earth world is completely in order oh right here this is uh job 12 and verse verse 7 but ask now the beast and they shall teach thee in the fowls of the air and they shall tell thee or speak to the earth and it shall tell thee and the fish of the sea shall declare unto thee <laughs> hey, the, hey actually let me start up man let me start at one this is job of 12 and verse one and job answered and said no no doubt but ye are people and wisdom shall shall die with you but but i but i have understanding as well as you i'm not in inferior to you yea who know knowest not such thing as these i am one one i am as one mocked of his neighbors who who called who called upon god and he answered me that that ju the just upright man is laughed to scorn and joe was being that uh being laughed to scorn by his friends but hey man we're being laughed to scorn man spiritually you can use that for us we're being laughed to scorn by everybody on this planet man we try to help, man. We're trying to fucking help you people, man. And y'all laugh us to scorn. Y'all scoff and scorn, man. We're not the one fucking destroying the planet Earth, man. We're not the ones destroying the planet Earth, man. We're not the ones in charge of the of the oil in the salt mines and, and fishing and all that, man. Esau Edom is doing this shit, man. But we're mocked to scorn by everybody. And when you say something to people, everyone looks at you like you're crazy. Verse five, he that is ready to slip with his feet is as a is as a lamp despised in the thoughts of him that is at ease. The tabernacles of robbers prosper and they that provoke Yahweh are secure into whose hand Yahweh bringeth abundantly. And that's true, man. The righteous prosper. I mean, the wicked prosper in this world, man. The robbers, man. I, man, I despise seeing this shit, man. Every day, I work in an Edomite area, Edomite neighborhood, and I see it, man. These the robbers who killed, raped, robbed our entire nation prosper off of us, man. And it's, it's sickening, man. Verse seven. But ask now the beasts, and they shall tell thee. 
and the fowls of the air, and they shall teach, tell, oh, I'll start over, ask now the beast, and they shall tell thee, and the fowls of the air, and they shall, tell, shall, shall, shall tell thee, or speak to the earth, and it shall tell thee, and the fish of the sea shall declare unto, unto thee, who, who knoweth not in all, all the, these things, the hand of the Lord have, have wrought, wrought this, and Basically, going on the point, ask these beasts, man. Ask the animal and ask the earth. Who's the one doing this to them, man? Who's killing? Who's who's destroying their their uh uh my, uh their they they, they sex grounds because <laughs> they having sex, <laughs> but they they migrating, not migrating. Uh, I said it earlier. Uh, damn, man, slip slip my tongue. Damn. When they when they come together, man, you know what you know what I'm saying. I, it's a lock I for, forgot the word I was using, but d you you know, man, just look at the earth, man. Look at the earth, and it'll tell you who's the one destroying it, who's the one fracking, who's the one taking well fracking, they, taking the oil out of earth, man. That's the blood of the earth, man. That's what keeps it lubricant and keeps earth earthquakes from happening. Who's doing all this shit, man? It ain't us. It ain't the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, but we're the ones to be blamed. We're the ones derided. We're the ones scoffed at. We're the ones mocked at. We're the ones that's been robbed and pillaged, but we get all the blame like we're doing this, man. That's why Yahweh Bashim Yahushua is going to be justified in destroying you Edomites, man, because you declare yourself not guilty, man. You don't think you've done anything, man, and we're the ones we're the ones to be blamed. I'm going to get that, and then I'm going to get uh, something else. This is uh, Acts 5. Acts 11 and verse 5, whose possessor slay them and hold themselves not guilty. And they and they sell sell them, and they that sell them say, Blessed be the Lord, for I am rich, and their own shepherds pity them not. And that's Esau, man. They don't give a, a rat's ass about us, man. But back to the back to the uh point. Hey, the Lord Yahweh by Shimmy Al Shai in due time is gonna set somebody up upon this earth that's not gonna destroy, that's not gonna rape. And pillage the, the people of it. It's not going to destroy the land of it. The Lord Yahweh by Shimei is Shai is going, to, is going to set someone up profitable for the earth. This is Wisdom of Solomon 6 and verse 3. Neither neither will will I go with the consuming envy. For such a man shall, shall have no fellowship with wisdom. But wisdom is the welfare. But, but, the, but the multitude of the wise is the welfare of the world. And a wise king is... Is the upholding of his people. And that's what they, the Lord Yahweh Shemiah Shai in due time is going to set up someone profitable to rule this earth, man. Because right now we have an evil, corrupt man destroying it, man. He's destroyed the people and he destroy, he's destroying the physical earth, man. And if he had time, he would destroy every living creature on this planet, man. And wouldn't even give a damn, man. You've seen the videos, man. Brothers and seen the videos of... of uh, Eat them of base of that clip of that Edomite going through destroying the earth, and at the end they show an alien show up and he, and he killed he killed the Edomite. This man has to go, man. Someone that that is going to rule this earth properly has to be set up in order, and that's uh, it. And that's going to that has to be set up, and that's going to be our Lord Yahweh Shai. Because if if Esau Edom had time, he would kill everybody, man. He's destroying the planet, and he must go, man. He must fucking go. This is Isaiah 24 and verse verse three. And the land shall be utterly empty and utterly spoiled for the for the for the Lord has spoken for, for the Lord has spoken this word. The earth mourneth and fadeth away. The 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 world languish languishes and fadeth away. The haughty people of the earth do languish. The the earth is defiled under the inhabitants thereof because they have have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenant. Therefore, the curse has devoured the earth, and they and they that dwell therein are desolate. Therefore, the inhabitants of the earth are burned, and no and few men left. So this is what's coming, man. The Lord Yahweh Shemiah Shai has to take the curse about this earth, man. That's the curse that's ruling it. Esau, Edom, and this devil, man. Esau, Edom, man, he has to go, man. The harbinger of death, man. Just like they said in, in, in uh, Planet Eights, man. The, the beast, man. 
let him and let him not rise nor possess the land, man. It got on Esau, man. He said he would not destroy his world only, but your he said he now he will not only destroy your world, but his also. Cut him off, man. Hey, they was going in on Esau. Because Esau Edom cannot fucking rule, man. Esau Edom has to be taken out of power, man. Soon and speedily, and he will through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai. With that, Lord will hope this lesson was edifying. All praise be to Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai. And Shalom.